Hey, well, I've had a history now. A wee disability rap is going up, up the grass. Oh no, you just struggle on like. And then you start lumping and blame me. Look, clean it up, my face are fine. That, that's a good sign. I'm not saying no dogs are out. Ah, oh, sure. Uh, an environment agency is looking after this place. They might like to see a wee tomb, don't they? That's a wee open tomb there, we get. That's unusual. Might not have asked something here. Just on a Sunday, no. Something down there, the wee hymn books and the wee Bibles, something on the wee knees and the something the wee black shoes on, the wee hats, no, no. Hey, well. Not on we see now. It wasn't a very big church. All the wonders are on one side. See, I like the. I'm not interested in the people who's on these headstones, I just want to get dates. That's some of the, I thought it was 8 years, 81 years. And not many 8 year old Wayne's got a big stone like that. 1875. So this church has been in ruins since before then. That's a pretty old stone there. Oh, there's, to get a tomb inside the church. A rich folk around Cookstown. Henry Lewis. There, see, he's from a big house. Lewis, who died at G O R something A L O. Larry, Larry, L O W, Larry, got, got a Larry house. Is there such a thing, got a Larry house? Ask Google. June 1824. I don't know if it is got or Larry, I'm just trying to work out. There's muscle buds there, there's bits broke off. But I know there's Larry's from here, you see, that's why I'm thinking Larry. Supposed to own a whole pile of properties. So I've learned a wee bit of history recently. So I'll type this in here now. And then guard, you always get guard, don't you? Probably get it, son. G O R T. Guard. G O R T A. L O W E R Y. So, uh. Got a Larry, got a Larry house. Let's see what comes up here. Let's see what comes up. House project. Limited. That's not what we want, is it? Well, it's in Cookstown. Cross Community Centre. That might be the actual house there. So I'm thinking a big estate. It's a big townhouse. And it's in the town centre. There's a church or chapel behind. So it might be worth reading up that. Well, there you are. That's probably looking at Cookstown, that house. I bought this place here then. Can I read the rest? There's age 59. So in there 59 normal. That's a, that's a different one there. Well, you're standing on. What's up there? That's what you eat. Carry that back fine. One past the uh, right after the road back fine. That's an old one. Like, why is all these cows back fine? It's Halloween and all the rest. Last thing we need is backfiring cars, and that wall wherever we go. That there's been patched up that wall there. You see there's a lintel there. That's a lintel. So there was a doorway there. So that could have been a crypt or something. I'll we'll have to check outside. There had to be a door into the church there. It's way low. What are you saying that like? That is lower than that one. It's still a bit low. Take a wee look, there's a window, there used to be a window there. So you wonder why they break these things up, wouldn't you? If they had a window there originally, who decided, hey boys, why Carl here, would he block up this window? 
Yeah, you know, you're in the last one there, like. I'm one of these stones there, it's been changed at one time, different colour. Got a sandstone for them. Couldn't get a match of stone, but that boy just happened to have a wee bit of lime in his yard bowl. So I can put this wee bit on for you here, and this one here. Or oh, it's going to take three months to get a wee piece up from Dublin, horse and cart. Ah, so I'll stick that wee one up. Other than that, there's not a big lot to see here, is it? There's is that a doorway or is that a bit knocked down there? Different stone in there, but it's... Could be an all wonder and then the lintel collapsed and then they just bricked it up. Alright, so I'm saying there's no wonders on that side, the wall's wonders on that side. Yeah, the one on the bottom bricked up, that one there, they're still there. So I presume that one was another wonder. So we have three wonders in this thing. One wonder's a bit different from the rest. I think we could have something on a pit. I'm always getting bored here, really. Well, I'm only here and you get, you take more of an interest, like. You can see a wee bit of the plaster all still on here, like. So it wouldn't have been bare, bare stones. Oh, right there. Probably different wee padlocks over the years. The door broke, put an old door on and different wee lock and took it a wee bit away. I love the way this big tube here now. To me that tomb looks better than the one in the church. Ah but both the church is holier. These boys, you know, all that money, chance of them getting to heaven's pretty slim. Look at this here. It's not the job there, isn't it? So they're just buried in the ground like everybody else. But uh, you see that see the metal ribs that's busting the concrete off. But that was all painted fancy. So it was sounds like a wee private chapel for the family. I wonder. See, I, I always think these rich people are dressed in them, but it just dawned on me now that these rich people might give you the name of houses. The one on the left is the wife of somebody. I think it was more than two in there, like, but... The only advantage of this crypt here, if it falls down, they're still buried in the ground, they've got a pile of rubble on top of them. Then again, look at the good condition the gates is in. That's how rot down, cast down, without that burden of stuff we get now. You see, see the wee robots there holding that together? No well. Today they would weld that. They had to put that wee pin the whole way through. So your, your blacksmith would have had a, like a spiky chisel. Heat that up, bang the hole in it. Bang the wee pin through. Bang that down with a hammer there. Bang that down with a hammer there. It's just imagine how long it takes to get that one wee piece on there. Like, I'm not how many pieces is on there. There are a couple of bolts up in the top. That's unusual to see bolts. It's holding its bracks, you know what that is? There must have been a main plate on there. That's since disappeared. And that bit of metal. It's off something else. See, they just hacked the uh, hacked the metal away there. So it's off something else. So it's a wee add on that's been put on at one time. Boy, so this wee bit of metal here, I don't know how that will do the job. But it wouldn't have been there, I don't think, when they built this place. But there's no chance of seeing that second one there. What date's on it? Can I make out any date? 21st November, age. I cannot see a year just. 10th of May, is it 18? See, my eyesight's not the best now, but I should be able to see it from here. I'll be guessing at 18, I couldn't say it's 18, I can see the one. Can't really make out the next number. There's a name there. Uh, to the memory of Hugh, something of something. It ends with a veil. That would be an all big house. There's an all big house around here. It ends with a veil. That's where these ones came from. But uh, the ones are drawn away, they buried.
these stone roof and all. She's given up. She has given up. You've given up, oh. I dare. That's the name of a farmer. So they probably contributed a big Monday church, so they had prime spot. But the name is right down here, like. Oh, I can't go on the big horse and carriages and take a wee whack in there. Same with these rich people. You wonder if the family misses them as much as the poor folk. You know, if, if Wayne's were taught up in an attic of a big mansion and they never seen their parents and the parents have travelled the world. When the parents die and get hurt in the house, do you mourn them, do you? You didn't see them, anyway. I'm sure they would miss them a bit, but it's not the same as somebody working on a coal mine and they like, have a collapse in the day and you have no food for the next day. You know, money coming in. You miss, you miss them a lot more. There's an interesting wee tomb over there. Oh, look at this one here. Hey, plenty of money around these parts here, I tell you. Plenty of money down this way. But I just don't have that tomb over there. That bit on the top, I don't think, I used to think the body was in that rectangle, it's not. The body's still on the ground, but you see it's got an uh, arch. So there must be a wee, a wee tomb under the ground where a vaulted ceiling. Although that was originally supposed to be mostly hidden on the ground. Now, putting a new telegraph pole over there, that must be with Pomeroy then. One of them Pomeroy paid the telegraph pole, big yard full. Anybody around the Pomeroy, it went not far away from Pomeroy here. Plenty of telegraph poles around this part of the country. Brand new ones, seen them the last time I was up there. Yeah, an old tomb over there. Because this is like the, the Valley of the Kings, this place here. See, you pass it all the time. A uh, new wall put up there with the Hurley Main Road up. Wonder who paid for that. Oh, dear, we. What's over the wall here? Now, I'll say there's a few ungodly people buried now. They used to bury wee babies, they're not wee stillborn babies. I'd say graveyards and all that. Uh, they were, were Christian, like, what the 1907s, the modern ones here. It's not often you see big headstones out there. Not when you get them in big cities, like, not towns. You even saw two people on there, like. They print this space. I see they used to big houses. They want to print this space for the bones, too. You see they keep all the wealthy ones together, like. This must be a wealthy road down here. 1902, that one there. I saw an unusual headstone on it. A wee wall. That's actually quite nice the way it's done. It's a long wee wall with two alcoves and the headstones are sitting in there. And originally they would have wee railings and all around it. But they separated the two of them. They mustn't have got on them by the marriage, didn't they? Well, that's the way they read it. Reverend John Knock Leslie. That's a reverend there. See, even they had plenty of money, like. Eighteen ninety two the wife. So he's before that. So what's this one over here? There must be a reddit. That's a different name. Henry R. Charles. So I don't know. It could have been still been related like some way. But obviously one person's paid for two graves, I don't know. Oh, crazy man here got oh, look a wee gate and all here, well. They got see something like this here, you get in Dublin and that big cemetery in Dublin. They have things like this. That's a proper wee uh, chapel boat from there. Talking 
We key and everything. We padlock and key. What? We have to wait there for it. We air brick at the top. I don't think it's a big building, but it looks like it's plastered rather than stone. So it could be cheap by stones, that's been plastered. Look at this over here, what's that about? What's that about there in the corner? Uh, that's the grave above, but the wall's collapsing. So they had to put that there to hold it. So if you dug a wee hole in there now, you'd probably grab a leg bone or something. So it's got a stone roof the same as the one above. But I think the one above is nice. So usually what they would do, they like them wee ones there. I'm coming, Wallow, I'm not going far. You always think the bodies are sitting inside. But I don't think they ever were. The wee chapel is, I can't remember where it is now. Um, uh, down there, public. And the two bodies are just in the floor inside. They had a wee altar along the back. The two bodies, they have impressed them now with glass. I was down with the boats, uh, and the Bally Shannon, we chap on Bally Shannon. The two bodies died in the wooden coffins, but the soil didn't touch the coffins. The coffins are technically in the ground, but the soil's not touching them. They've got a wee stone uh, out, outside. You put your coffin in, you put on your stone lid, and then you built the chapel over the top. And the stone lid would probably be the same as these other headstones, with the names and all on it. But down there, you know how like tourists, they've removed the stone lids and they put glass on, put in a couple of light bulbs and they put a wee door on, a wee, uh, f the door lies open and a wee collection box, you know. And a wee collection box that they have, well, that grave's making them some money. So that's been patched up there at some time. See, it's concrete, reinforced concrete, so it's been patched up since long before it was built, so it must have been starting to fall down. So it's not built as well as the one on the top. It may look more impressive from far back, but it's just cheap out stone and probably bricks that's just plastered over to look like stone. But the one above is a bit cruder, but it's actually real stone. So it's, it's weathered a lot better. Coming down here. I don't know what rain's coming in the graveyard for. I think I'm a ghost now. I think I'm a ghost. Do, 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 do. <laughs> well, no, well. 1909, I mean that one there. 1902 there. That's just a hundred years ago. But you see the stone? See that stone wall? That's the same as Drum Manor. I wouldn't be surprised if that stone has been taken from a stately home that's been knocked down. Somebody's reused that stone. There's been some house somewhere that's been knocked down. And they've, they've used, they wouldn't have, I don't think they would have went to that effort for a grave. And that's why it is the way it is. Same stone missing's not done in these prisons because the rest of the grave is not done with a fancy stone. It's, it's rare bricks. Stone on the cheap. The other stone in the back. Me and my things there. They could have came from whatever house that back came from. Knock these houses down now. Oh, you sell out bits off second hand, Nick. Like. All these boys are gambling debts and all. I see I got there, there's real stone. See the difference? So when they both were done, they probably look pretty similar. But they've got the real money, they've used the real stuff, the real McCoy. And even their stone's all decorated, it's got all these wee lines and all carved on it. I mean, the boy didn't up with chisel. It costs more money, it's not that we couldn't do it. They probably got a junior stone mason to, to do the lines. They practice their skills. But uh, the fact they had the money to pay it, the very top stones were more elaborate. And again, they would have had the wee bars and all around it. It's got roses and everything, and this that one there's definitely more elaborate there. 1872. It was right in the bottom, but I think it's just a religious thing. Nothing to say who he was or where he's from. 
So that one has got an empty plot. Me and your mom and dad from died in the war somewhere, 1902. So the 1897, 1902, maybe the last generation of land over in France. Well, where's the stop? Well, I know you're bored, like, but we're going to go out to eat Cabin Wood next. You'd like the main street, wouldn't you? Ah, uh, with too many loud cars, this time of day, Pet. Well, I think it's worth, well, look at this wee grave up here, Pet. I don't like walking across people's graves. Because I always think, people don't walk in the like of that, and that we're walking on the poor people's. And that, that, that doesn't, I don't agree in that. You just walk the grass, there's the poor folk who couldn't afford a headstone. And then the rich people, you don't walk on theirs, like. But right, we should go from headstone to headstone. And any blank bit of grass, leave it out. Yeah, see, the thing is, I'm just about here now. Your man's buried on the ground and such, but I don't think he's in the clay. Look. See, he's got a wee arch there. So that's a wee vault underneath. That's a vault. So these are the things here. If you broke that panel, it's full of stones. But just, it makes it very hard for a body snatcher. If a body snatcher wants to get you, he has to move all that away. It's not going to happen. So we're putting them on top, less chance of body snatchers pinching your body. But I reckon once you move that in this slab, it's an actual room. And the reason why it's built in the hull, you need a wee bit of drainage. And you don't want to fill up your water. So you've got a wee bit of drainage there. What date's that? Can't even make it out. You know, if you came here with a piece of paper and a crayon, you could probably get them writing. I'd be nice if they don't have a wee sign beside each one, like they have in the public. Now inside there, one of the wonders is bricked up. There's where it's bricked up. The tomb on the outside. Oh, that's in the church here. Oh, that wee stone there. I thought the start it might have been, you know, that obviously that wasn't on the church. It's come off another building. The way she's been carved out, that's been rounded off. So that's the second half stone off another building. Could have been an earlier church. Well, they were recycling away back then. I was trying to make, it's very hard to make out where the wonder was there. You could not really see where the wonder was. Comparing the one over there, you see it better from the inside. That's a pretty good one, isn't it? That's 1680. Sometimes things go up to show up better than the GoPro, you know. What dates are that there? Ah, uh, see it? I'll go back to the house and look at it on the big TV. It'll show up better. That's very clear right now. That's been redone there. Somebody's been screwing it out there. That's too clear. You see the stone's fresh. So somebody's been at this one. 1680. Hey, that's old, isn't it? 1680. That's before the Battle of the Barn. This vault. They even call it a proper vault, like it's a proper room, like this vault. I don't know, I see. I'll, I'll put this. What's this camera doing now? I'll just scan this across and I'll see if it will work out right when I get to the house. Oh, that's going to make the movie longer, like, but what can you do? Stuarts. Of Kelly Moon. So, hold on a minute. Kelly Moon Castle is in uh, in a skill. The cottage wood that we're going to belongs to National Trust is their property. So that's the property. That's what the family's buried there, like. So they built the vault in 18, 1680. The family probably nobody was dead in 1680. The vault was it was meant to hold all the generations coming after that from 1680. So 1680, they built this vault. So the 
wonder what age the castle is. The castle can't be much older than that. But like, the castle now is a house. I would say about a lot rougher in them days because locals would have been attacking them. Like, among those last laid here are. So they don't know who the first ones are. The last ones. So the very stout, like it's probably most folk can't even read. Like, I will chuck them in there. There's an there's a spare gap on there. I put them in there. James Stewart, 1742 to 1821. Henry's brother, 1748 to 1840. And those, and these three children of James Stewart, William, Mary, um, Richard. Richard Rector of Kildress. Also, see, he's got the money's worth. You, you bought one of these big things, you might, you, you know, storage is expensive. You want to fill it up, like. But you think the first boy the very start, the boy paid the money in 1680, it's barely mentioned. And among those last lady here, what about the first? The first ones had he paid for this thing. They had a mortgage on it. So when was the very last one put on? The very last one probably didn't get the name on. He was never to pay for it. I got to know when they count. 1913, age 74. Uh, the son, Reverend Cannon, Joseph Atkinson, Stuart, M.A. of Kilo. Well, you're in the right of history, wow! You're in the right of history! You know, I don't know. You do you you do enough about this uh sit down or stand up protest. Uh, you do enough for badness. I'm trying to get around this way, around this way, over this way, on to this way. Is one moving? No. Is one moving? You don't see a uh, ground force having this problem. They don't. Oh uh, the last one on it and the son Henry Edward Henry Stuart of Kill O Kill O. Is that W E N? Win, win. Kill O one. D nineteen fourteen, age seventy six. But you might know when that was originally built, there would have been a gate on there. I would say the original owners, the tablets are inside. They would have a wee shelf, and the wee tablet is on the shelf with the name and all on it. And probably the last ones would probably fill up. The shelves would fill up. The bottom, the rest, and between, like that's they put down there and how they break it up there. So how do you go from Killy Moon to Killaween? It's Killy Moon up there. Killo. That's not, it's definitely not an M. That's not an O. That's not a moon like. Kill a moon. Kill a, kill a moon. Kill a moon. Kill a well. Oh, we've been investigation. I can't, there's too much house to investigate. Well, I'm a day before we investigate all this. But back when they built that, they really take a wonder after the church. I'm oh, sure the church done well, and that's what it is. We've got a wee payment. Who do they have for neighbours? There's one there now, look, see it open. It's just full of rocks and stuff. It's just hollow. You see, there's some type people there. Erected by Anne M. Whatever it is. As a tribute of love and memory of her beloved husband. So, she could just put it up for me, for such a person, for such a person, but oh, she paid the money, she wanted the locals to know she paid for this, like. That's out of her diary here, like. So her name had to come first. He died at 25. I could have fed off a horse or something. 1866.
18 area that one. Oh, the farm, talk to the farm. It's just as interesting, isn't it? I can't there's a drainage pipe. There's a wee tree and all grown there, so there was that would have wrecked it there. Eh? That would have wrecked it. It's curious you can't make out the wonder. So I keep like the this one the here to the walls. So there's your wonder there, look, on this side. If you go level now, there's a the wonder over here. But say the whole thing's been completely changed. So I would say that the the lintel broke, the wall fell down, and just coming back the whole thing up. But that could have been done like a hundred years ago when that was still a ruin. But look at this thing here now, there must have been a wall coming out here. <laughs> See this wall over here? Like, that's history to be looked at. We're going to have to go now, the wall is sitting too much here. But we're going out of uh, cottage wood. And uh, that's a bit of a mess, that grave, isn't it? That'd be one there, you'd think. See, there's a path there going to the wall. So there might have been a wee gateway in here originally before that road was done up. And they've done the road up, they raised it up a bit. And they put that new supporting wall on. So the wee path goes nowhere now. I think this would have had a wee wall around it, but it's since disappeared. But there's somebody looking after this place. Well, head back now, well, that's enough excitement there. But do I overdo it? There's all the wee trees, got wee X's marked on them, pet. Meeting the fit. See, when down the main road, there's what you see here. This is what, this is what stands out. But for the size of the graveyard, there must be some collection box in that church there. Eh? Can't there are rich people buried in here? I'm sure there's lots of poor people as well. But like probably got a graveyard, the very poor one get dug up and tossed out. That there could be a wee grave put in there, you know. You don't know, like, why, why is that bricked in there? There's nothing to tell you. Wooden lantern holding the top up. Well, that's, that's definitely the best we vault over there. Proper wee stone, pointing, everything's perfect. And if, because it's left open, air gets at it. And the stone's able to dry off. Come on out, well, that's enough excitement now. There's the name of the church. Derry Lorne Church. If you're looking for it, that's the Oma Road there now, leaving Cookstown. Can I miss it? Noisy cars turn up. You hear noisy cars turn up, but that's the normal road. I was seeing a lot of noisy cars last. I was up that road wall. I'll tell you, well, that's a worth of seeing. Now you know. I'm always passing these places, and you never, you never think of stopping. We're right back to the car now. So this is Old Rectory Park. So I can only presume that the actual house, the rectory house, must have stood in this spot here. Ah, probably a big grand house. Now you see the size of that man's grave? you think it would have had a wall, but probably the wall now has been knocked down the way in the road. The big tree there is probably all that's left of the actual rectory. You can see the size of the tree deliberately hasn't been taken away completely. It's dead, but they've left a bit of it there. That's probably what remains of the rectory grounds. And I say we wins are still enjoy trying to claim that, you know. You get the other one leaving themselves in the hospital. That's one of the health and safety they haven't fenced it off. 
But other than that, there's nothing to see in Frectory. Completely gone, well, completely gone. Now we've got a wasteland in there now, so called wasteland. Look, they're going to build more houses here sometime. So uh, that's what these signs are. And used to come, this will be all housing. Is it worth trying to walk around here now? What do you see? What's here? Ah, there's a bit of flight tip on there. You get that in these type of places. It's pretty overgrown, I like. But it basically is, it's a lot of land there, but the town sort of goes right around it. And those the estates, so it's a, it's a bit of a, it's landlocked now, and I like. So it's, it's going to be houses. There's a pile of trees behind there. I wonder if that's going to be some kind of wee wood there, you know, or is that part of the same field? I, I can't see them ever being allowed to cut down that number of trees to plant the bull houses. Well, there's a wee track going down here. Why well, would I not be track a minute? Come on, well, come on, let's be track here to see if it goes down them trees. Come on, like somebody's been driving down here. That's how it would have been formed originally. Ah, oh, they're flight up, and that's why they're coming down here. There's tarmac. They say tarmac can be 100% recycled. So, why do they flight tip us? Even the brand new stuff, the bullers want to dump it, they don't want to take it back. She's not going to come now, you see. But that might be worth a time we walk down there. Some of them have trees down there, great big trees. I would presume there'll be a stream along the bottom of that. But she ain't coming today. Ain't going to force her. That's the only really thing is now. If we wallows got this lymphoma. There's too many places to go, so they won't have enough time to do all these places. You busy scratching yourself? You having a wee scratch? You want me to scratch you? You want me to give you a wee scratch? How long do we see? You need a hand? Where do I give you a wee scratch? Where's the scratchy? Down there scratchy? Up there scratchy? Where, where's it? Oh, there, it's up there. Have I got the spot? Have I got the spot? Have I got the spot? Oh, I have to give you a hand. Get rid of that itch. Get rid of that itch. There we go. Up we go now, honey.